Now, this is the same type of problem except with uh, formula units because it's an ionic compound. And the term formula units more or less acts as molecules because we've got this whole thing here and, and multiple atoms and elements in them. But let me step you through how to do this one as well. It says how many ammonium carbonate, and this one I did get the formula, so this is fair game on your um, homework quizzes and exams. Uh, how many ammonium carbonate formula units are there in 26.8 grams of ammonium carbonate? All right, so my given, 26.8 grams ammonium carbonate, and I'm just going to write out that formula. And I'm going to make my long picket fence here because I have a feeling that because I write this out each time, it's going to be a little longer. Um, and let's see. So I need a molar mass. And one thing to keep in mind as you work these problems is we don't know that many chemistry conversion factors yet. We know molar mass and we know um, Avogadro's number. And so those are going to be the bulk of what we're doing now. It gets a little more complicated, but it's still actually pretty much only that. Um, we'll learn some new ways to use those as well. All right, so molar mass is a little more complicated now because now we have to go through and do all of our elements, make sure we hit up all of the uh, right numbers of atoms. So molar mass is going to be two nitrogens, eight hydrogens, a, one carbon, and three oxygens. So I have my periodic table right here. And um, let's see if I can do this all. In, I don't know if I can or not. I think we got most of them, but we don't have hydrogen. All right, so let's see what we got here. We got two times nitrogen, which is 14.01. Oh, my parentheses issue. Well, um, plus eight times hydrogen, and I'm gonna to have to do eight times 1.008, plus, uh, I think I'm all right now, 12.01 plus, uh, better use parentheses again, three times 16, 48, good. I get 96.09 for four sig figs for my molar mass. And you can see we're going a little bit faster with the molar mass calculations, only if you're comfortable. One mole. And still got to write, I still write the entire thing out there. All right. Good. And now uh, for this one, it's still Avogadro's number. And we're going to put uh, one mole. and 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd. And because it's not technically a molecule, although if you wrote molecules here, I'm not gonna penalize you, but um, it's technically formula units. Of ammonium carbonate. And so now again, it's the math is the same as the last problem for H2O. But this time we have formula units as our answer for this one, as part of the units. Let's see, grams of this cancels, yes. I like to double check that my units cancel, then it's multiplying 26.8 divided by 96.09 times 6.022 exponent 23rd. This time I get 1.679, round that up, 1.68 times 10 to the 23rd. And my final units are formula units, ammonium carbonate. Nice.